my name is Pamela O'Connor. I'm coordinator of academic services in the Rutland Center. I oversee the Department of Arts and Humanities. So Cafe CCV is at our evening of the arts. It's when all the art classes get together and display the work that they've done for 15 weeks. We have digital arts such as digital photography and multimedia communications. Uh, tonight we have drawing, paper arts, we have a color theory class showing their work. It's a really exciting evening. It's a great time for our students to show their work and show their stuff. So our midterm project, um, we had the requirement, we had a certain height and width to bring that into a sculpture. Um, so I <laughs> rolled a lot, a lot of paper. How long did it take you to do? I think at least 20 hours. It was a long time. Did you use glow? Yes, lots of glue. <laughs> well, these are um, samples of handmade paper. Oh, okay. And uh, as long as you start with a nice, say, like a cotton um, interval, you can add things to make your paper more interesting and have better textures. Some of the favorite things that I like to incorporate in my home are herbs and flower petals because then when you make your note cards and your stationery, the person opens the envelope and they get the smell of the marjoram or the peony leaves or whatever else you put in there. Hello, my name is Porto Silva Jr. and this video is for multimedia apps and tools. I decided to do this video because I wanted to like show people, whoever is watching this, like how to survive in Vermont in the springtime and like what your essentials are if you want to do this for fun or by some chance you get lost in the woods and you don't know what to do. My name is Steph. The class is Color Theory with Susanna Colby. And we had to make a sculpture out of found items. And I had already been thinking of making a project for some friends of mine out of bottle caps. So I had the bottle caps already. Uh, originally, I wanted them to be all Vermont beers. Unfortunately, the person who donated the caps to me does not drink all Vermont beers. So I tried to make it <laughs> homey to me, who's grown up in Vermont. So I did the VT, and I tried to make these guys be like the white snow-capped mountains and use green and blue to represent our Vermont flag and I try to use some of the gold and red to represent apples and make it kind of look like a, an apple tree. And I have little hikers down here because of the Appalachian Trail and then some little trees which is shed which is a Vermont beer. I am Amber Piper. Um, this is Ceramics 1 class. My favorite piece would probably be this altered pinch ball. You start with a ball of clay, you stick your thumb down in the middle of it, and then you just pinch around in the circle until you get a bowl shape. Hi, I'm Crystal Bean. Um, I'm here at Cafe CCB tonight to showcase my drawing one work. I needed to do something with my time and I said, you know, this would be the perfect time to follow my dreams and to get that art education and to make a living doing something that I like to do rather than just doing something that you learn to do to make a living. So proximity was important for me. Um, I live 12 minutes down the street. CCV was a logical step. It's going to help me get to where I want to be.